how's it going this is arsh from fast culture and welcome to episode 1 of music production hacks with fast culture so today we're going to be using xfer records serum to make this drum kit all the drum sounds you're going to make from scratch using only xfer serum nothing else no eqs no plugins nothing besides xfer serum to make this entire kit from scratch all right if you like the video make sure you hit the subscribe button let's get started make a kick drum first so we go here serum is already here so let's see what it sounds like yeah so that's going to become a kick drum somehow let's go so i really like the analog bd sign over here so let's make the envelope a little snappy uh, i want to kill the sustain here now what i want to do is make this envelope act on the level so it kind of like acts more like a transient so let's pull it back yeah and now we go to lfm modulation lfm modulation in serum is very hectic you can make a lot of patterns with this and stuff but i want to make a snappy quick lfo yeah not that much yeah. uh, on envelope mode take it to its course to the course tuning yeah let's take this come on yeah so Yeah, that started sounding a kick drum. Let's see. Let's find the right pitch. No. Yeah, I like that. I kind of like that. Yeah, so you got a kick in place. Now, it's also its noise generators are great. So, I want to use some noise on this to add some click to the kick. So, let's make put a kick attack one shot mode. Let's see now. Nice. I like this. This is very nice. It works nicely. It sounds pretty good. Let's see more. I like this. Thirteen on this is working really. nicely all right so that's kind of the basis of a kick drum it's very let me see if i just want to cut the take a little bit so i can make a damn snappy like this but i don't let's see how much you want to open it up yeah that's got a lot of low end i like it let's go to the fx let's add some eq to it i just want to add some more low end although it's quite got quite a bit of low end but let's see uh frequency just in the lower registers maybe under 100 let's see this q is okay let's try this out yeah it's getting some body there nice i want some high end not really i'm quite okay with the high end of this kick drum not more add a bit of compression make it a little more hectic if you can all right so let's go ratio is 3 for us to 1 let's get don't want a very hectic threshold attack attack can be a little slow be a little slow in the release so it breathes give it some gain it's 0.5 on my meter so i'm safe i'm quite happy with this so now just bounce this kick drum and we are done with step 1 you got a kick in place let's go kick set up all right so we've got a amazing now step 2 which is making the snare slash clap so i'm going to go for more of a clap type sound so let's open serum first let's see what you got all right so that sounds nothing like a clap 
slash snare so what i want is something with a lot of uh, like harmonic content i actually like this one let's go for the distortion yeah let's use this and we're gonna use oscillator b and we're gonna use it to fm synthesize oscillator one all right so in this i want it to be a little analog bd sign same one cool take the level down put uh what fm from b and let's see cool we've got something now let's envelope shape it uh, so we want again no sustain and we want it to be short transient all right nice now let's go to lfo one i love this the lfo here so we use envelope again in this uh, take off bpm take off this let's make like let's make it a little flammy so we'll have to make a bunch of points in this let's do this okay so i've got this i've got this no i don't want that okay so i've got this over here what this make a couple of more points snap it down over here snap it up and yeah we've got something so now let's send this lfo to this thing's level for oscillator one okay now i need i need to feel the flam basically okay so we've got something happening uh now let's also put this on the course pitch over here started sounding like a clap a little bit let me see if i need to i'm okay with that much let's change the wave table position and see again let's not randomize this dead a noise generator in this so let's see noise generator i want one of the analog circuitries let's go. let's use the white noise and let's put lfo1 on the white noise so we get the same type of modulation happening on the white noise all right so let's do this and let's yeah let's try this out Cool. I like the way that's sounding. Actually, like this slightly drier sound a little more. It's also cool. I like this J60 sound. Let's go with this for right now. Let's try Unision so we can stereo the clap a little bit, give it some width. Now I want to use a filter on this and maybe use an envelope one. Just cut it and open it a little bit. So put on the cutoff. Let's see. Yeah. Put the wave table position a little more. Okay, that's just noise. But I also want a bit of a 250 type knock to this, so let's use this sub oscillator and let's see what we can do with this. Okay, I want to take the envelope and put it to this level thing. Yeah, so you can hear the bit of knock to it. Yeah, nice. I like it now let's go to the fx and i want to add some again compression to this let's see this threshold 
not too much. Let's kill the transient a bit. Now let's open it. Nice. Yeah, it's breathing. It's breathing. Add a bit of gain. I like it. EQ. Let's let's give it a bit of a 250 knock. Let's see how it sounds. 250 Q. I want it to be around 200 to 50. Too much. Somewhere here. Open up the Q a little bit. Yeah. I'm good with that. Let's try adding some reverb. Let's see what happens. I can actually low cut it a little bit. I think that's sounding pretty good. It's fine. So now let's just bounce this and we've got our snare. Bounce in place. Serum. Clap. Let's do this. Clap has been bounced. Nice. For this, we don't need the oscillator. At least, I don't use it. And I just open the noise. Uh, let's get the level up. Let's now shape the envelope a little bit. Kill the sustain. I want to make it a really fast transient over here, okay? Nice. Now, I really like their organics section. And I like this one a lot. I can too. Yeah, it makes it sound really like a hat, right? This is too close, maybe this much. Let's see the pitch. Nah. Kind of liked it where it was. Yeah. Cool. Easy. Yeah, that sounds pretty good. Like nice and closed, you know. Let's add a filter. I want to go for a low six. Right, and we modulate to the noise. Okay, so I want this. Actually, want like a high cut. What am I? High six, yeah. So I want to take the same envelope and put it on the cut off. I like that. Some drive. A little bit. Then. Yeah, that's nice. Let's go to the FX matrix and let's put on the. Let's add some distortion to this. Yeah, I like that. Go back to the oscillator. Let's. Yeah, I think that's the amount we need. So that's a make you first. Cut the low out a little bit. I think we can cut the low. Yeah. Kill the Q. What frequency are we cutting till 200 is fine. Let's see when I add some high end. Not too much. It gives it a bit of body. Nah. I'm good with that. And let's give it a bit of verb. Not this much. Let's give it some plate verb. Very little. Yeah, kind of just like a slap back. Yeah. Maybe a little lesser. Yeah, that sounds pretty good to me. Let's bounce this out getting closer to making a beat yeah nice so now we are moving on to making the hats on the open hat right so for this again we'll just use the noise oscillator we need nothing besides the noise all right let's get the level up kill the sustain again so we have a transient yeah for this 
yeah we need a longer sound there i love this sor we have atmos now yeah let's try making it with this let's just see yeah add the filter to it let's take the noise i want to add the envelope also in this again we're gonna go for the high low no high 24 i like this one let's do a little bit of envelope modulation to the filter and see what happens open it up no yeah i kind of like that give it a bit of a yeah so nice and clean we can open up the transient a bit hold on yeah that works let's add some distortion to it uh, i like the hot clip for this let's try it a bit and see yeah that sounds pretty neat let's add some eq do we really need some eq on this let's just see I don't want to cut the lows. I don't want to give it any highs also, a little bit. Yeah, that makes it pop out a little bit. Nice. Just want to add a bit of reverb to this. Add a plate. Really lower the mix. Pre delay. Bit of dampening, little bit less. Yeah, I like the sound of that, man. Let's bounce this, and we've gotten our open hi hats now. So the fundamentals for this will be pretty similar to what we did with the kick drum, but like, I'm gonna pitch it up and give it a different uh, timbre and stuff. Let's see how this works out. Alright, so first I want to go back to my analog BD sign. Alright, let's reduce the sustain, make it a bit of a transient. Yeah, short. Right, and give this to the envelope. And yeah. envelope okay now you go to the LFO have like again a really snappy LFO running here which I want to take to the course but over here I want more of a pitch variant happening so let's see what's happening happens okay and I want to add a bit, bit of it to the octave as well Let's give it some harmonic content. Okay. Let's add a bit of a noise also to it. Let's try some interesting sound on top. Let's see this one. Analog flow. I like this one. Like oh, this way. Let's give it a bit of a. I'm liking that. Let's go to the FX. Let's 
give it some compression that's killed everything some low end a little bit of open short release I like that let's give it some EQ I just want to give it some high end and nothing else let's bring out the harmonic content of it a little bit more I like it quite happy with that yeah I can live with that okay so you got like a conga tom one type of thing like a high tom like you know so let's do this we now have almost a groove in place now for the final piece of the puzzle let's make one cool percussion sound which is kind of weird and let's switch this off let's just find a nice noise filter filter they have this nice wind chimes let's try one of the atmospheres i like this i kind of like crickets right yeah so let's use these let's kill the sustain a little bit let's see nice let's add an oscillator let's add one of the vowel ones this time a duda coil let's see what this does yeah it's already cool kind of right so let's take uh i'll give it to this let's see yeah nice let's i like this so let me just add this to the level Let's open this up a little bit. I kind of like this. Give it a bit of a stereo feeling. Nice. Add some distortion. do a little bit of fm modulation which is happening fmb now fmb i'm going to just open the sign yeah yeah i think they'll make a cool like in between type of thing yeah so let's bounce this and i think we're done Thank you so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you hit the like button. Uh subscribe to the video and hit the notification bell to get frequent updates and do write a comment and say whatever you want to me. I would love to hear anything from you at all. And if you guys have any requests or questions, I would love to take them. Also, uh check out Fast Culture's music on our YouTube channel on Apple Music Spotify and various other channels I'll be giving the link below in the description and as always what we're going to do is that the samples and the presets we made are going to be available in the description below all right so make sure you get your hands on them and use them in your own productions thank you so much for watching and once again hit subscribe thank you